is the Lord of Lords. This is a method given to a Bible teacher in the church, sometimes called Sunday school teacher, and sometimes called first Bible teacher in the church. The Bible is a book that must be handed with very care. It's not just a book, it's a book. God gave special gift to those who understand and teach the word. The Bible is clearly a different book. There has been many heresies in the history of Christianity, but they are still uh, in the Mauritius, in South Korea, in the United States, everywhere. But if we don't have more guidance in the Holy Spirit, they interpret and teach the Bible without the Holy Spirit, it will clearly lead us down the wrong pathway. Another one is the face. Is this the gift or this gift of the Holy Spirit? Yes, it is. Certainly, some people have a great faith than others. God looks for people who pray for the church and who share God's dreams and who pray. Great of faith is the gift of the Holy Spirit. It is a little different from the secret faith. We all have Faith for somebody that literally have a great faith, like Abraham and David. In all circumstances, trust in God, being able to believe in God, this is a gift of the Holy Spirit. Today, we are going to take a quick look at the nine gifts, but the most important one is this gift of faith. And then, we also find out another gift from the Holy Spirit. This is a gift of healing. It's called it Charismata Himato. This is a gift of healing. This is a gift of healing the body, for the mind, for the soul. As you know, healthcare system in New Testament age and its ways are very different. We got a proper doctor in other ages. Many things do not be cured in those days and but can be cured in the hospital. Thank you. However, there are still many diseases of the heart and soul and mind in this age, this century. God healed those through the Holy Spirit and God healed the world through the church. Do you believe it? And then this is the power to work together. Our God is certainly performing doing miracles in this moment. When we pray, the devil retreat. Sometimes science cannot explain everything in this world, but God is still doing his miracles in this time, in this place. Do you believe it? And if you are believing, we take a belief and pray. And six is a bit of purpose. He started to explain and to preach. Uh, and then uh, the son comes from the gift and spirit and the gift of speaking in tongues. This section should be really with very caution. There are problems in this age certainly. But if we all read our text carefully, the gift of prophecy is only allowed in the church, not outside of the church. When I was living in South Africa, I had met a large prophet. But some prophets are real, or some prophets are not real. But how can I tell who is real, who is not real? But that is it. Somebody doing prophet in the church is real, or somebody is doing prophet in outside of the church to make money. For him or for himself, it's not real prophet. It's very prophet in the Bible is not just a little to predict the future. Okay, let me prophet. Okay, let me know your guys tomorrow's weather. No matter what. But it's kind of seeing of the God's dream. In today's Corinthian age, Paul says, in the early churches, there were prophets in the church. This is because at the time, this 
after 30 groups of new tests but well, not yet complete. But today, we will have the complete file. It is a complete proper shortcut. We don't need to rely on the human to perform. We have our own bike. Please, don't look away to around the, the outside of the shops to the, their profit. If someone make a profit compulsory against the rider, it's a great profit. The closing to the rider profit today, in this day, is kind of what should be done in the shops. We see the profit in the rider. It's dreaming, not dream dream. But it does the sonic spirit. It studies spirit, here is your diacritic domination. In this world, there are definitely an evil spirit and a good spirit at the same time. But if your heart is filled with an evil spirit, your life will be ruined. But what if you are ruined by poor spirit? Especially the church. The evil spirit of division, jealousy can come in. But why God give special gifts to the leader of the church? And then the last one is the gift of souls. In the New Testament, thoughts is not a, just a foreign language. But it's something you have to inquire about. Songs are metacostals, usually in politics, the most of them are real. But however, the gift of the songs is not complete in itself. There are mostly gifts of interpreting the gift of songs. Since we are not in the Bible story, but we are not, we can dig into more deeply because we are not in the Bible story. We can go just roughly in this country. Yes. But today's scripture talk about nine of the major But let Ask the question, why did our God give us this gift of the Holy Spirit? Why our God gave us the Holy Spirit? Sometimes the praise, sometimes the healing, sometimes the prophet. Why? Okay, let me ask you much easier. Why does a spider man have a shot? No. Why? Does the Spider Man have a shot you know? Why? Very simple. To say the word, everybody knows. Why does Spider Man and Shooter Man have all superpowers? Everybody knows. To say the word. But sometimes it's always true. But everybody knows the first time. But why does our God give us the gift of the Holy Spirit to? Maybe he wants to find a solution because he loves us. He wanted to give us what is the best for us. But why? Because God gave us the gift of the Holy Spirit for his church, his church, to protect him, to defend him, to make him grow healthy. God gave you the if the Holy Spirit to the issues. But who gives the gifts? Who gives your gift? Everybody knows. He says, it's different. The Holy Spirit gives them and you and us the Holy Spirit. But why don't we make the gift the Holy Spirit ourselves? Well, because we can boast ourselves. Oh, I have a gift to some special gift. Because he gave us. Why? Because to protect his church. Sometimes we need to pray to God. God gave me a gift of the Holy Spirit. Because we most not want to give to this gift is the gift of faith. The gift of faith. But now, how can I tell if this gift is from the Holy Spirit or from the mother spirit? It's very simple. If your gift is defending the church, talking the church, it's definitely from the Holy Spirit. But if this gift is just for yourself, 
It's similar to the Alma God Post. There are prophets, pastors, and prophets today who claim to be gifted by the Holy Spirit. Sometimes they will start their gift outside of church, but in the scripture, by the scripture, Paul explained the gift of Holy Spirit in a letter called the First Corinthians. This is different to the church. The gift of Holy Spirit are for the church. They are not for ourselves. Today we will celebrate the Lord's Because we have a Holy Communion together. Yeah, there is a time when the gift of uh, the Holy Spirit are given. If the Holy Spirit were not present in this sacrament time, it will be the people the next time of bread, bread and wine, but sometimes grape to strength. But we believe the Holy Spirit is present in our communion time, and that is where the Holy Spirit begins. But if the Holy Spirit comes to an individual, but they also come to the church. The Holy Spirit now can come on the center of us. The second the Holy Spirit gave us God's work. He gave us faith. He healed our sickness in communion. It just, it's not, sometimes it looks like a spread and wise job, but when the pastor, they then bless and pass up all We receive the not just bread, it's Jesus bread and wine and Jesus body and blood. We are sharing the his suffering and his resurrection. This is not just the rhetoric. We are nearly in the presence of God. How? By the power of the Holy Spirit. This is a Sixteen time to our Holy Spirit is coming. Especially, we are now we are going to join our uh, Jesus Christ suffering, our resurrection, with the Holy Spirit. And then now we can train ourselves in our mind. Okay. Now I'm ready to I'm ready to listen to your voice. Please talk to our mind, talk to our Place, don't tell of time, don't tell of pain, and change everything by your Holy Spirit. If you are, we, are, we don't have any Holy Spirit's aid, it's nothing, it's nothing to me. But compared to the cross, suffering of Jesus Christ, listen, we can listen to the voice, our Holy Spirit, speak to us. This is today's. Our laws. Let me pray. Gracious God, God of wisdom, sometimes your word seems to so clear to us, yeah. And a lot of times it's a force with a lot of challenge. Please send your Holy Spirit to guide us as we listen to the scripture. Help us. Hear your word for our times and our lives to the grace of Christ, the living one. In Jesus' name, Amen. Amen. Now we are having a